டே ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் ரயானிக் ஈக்லிபிரியம் இன் த ஏர்லியர் கிளாஸ் வி ஹவ் சீன் அபவுட் ஹைட்ரஜனி ஆன் கான்சன்ட்ரேஷன் யூஸ்வலி நீ நீட்டு ஒரு சொல்யூஷன் ஹைட்ரஜன் ஆன் கான்சன்ட்ரேஷன் ஆர் ஹைட்ரோனியம் ஆன் கான்சன்ட்ரேஷன் இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு ஹைட்ராக்சைடு ஆன் கான்சன்ட்ரேஷன் விச் இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு ஒன் இன் டென் பவர் மைனஸ் செவன் மோல் பர் டெசிமீட்டர் கியூப் தட்ஸ் வாட் வி ஹவ் கிவன் it is applicable for <coughs> any neutral solution aqueous solution water for acid solution it is greater than this that is greater than this for alkaline solution it is greater than this or greater than this order may be so that's what we have seen but the value 10 power minus 7 minus 6 if the concentration happens to be say 6.84 into 10 power minus 5 7.4 in 10 power minus 3, 5.95 in 10 power minus 6, see if I say, the number is not uh, easily understandable as the number goes very, very small. Even if I say, this is greater than this, we may have a little bit confusion. All right. So the comparison is not easier. Therefore, Saramson introduced what is called pH scale. it was introduced by saramson according to him ph is nothing but negative logarithm to the base ten of hydroxide ion concentration negative logarithm to the base ten of hydrogen ion concentration or hydronium ion concentration that is ph we used to write small p and capital h that's all positively charged hydrogen ion concentration in that way we can take Suppose if the concentration of hydrogen ion happens to be, say, 10 power minus 1, the pH value will be minus log to the base 10, 10 power minus 1. Therefore, minus 1, if it comes over to the front, it will become, uh, we know the formula, log x power a is equal to a log x. Therefore, when it comes over here, we will be getting minus into minus plus, plus 1 log 10. Log 10, the value of log 10 is nothing but 1. Because two digits, for two digits characteristic is 1. And the logarithmic value is 0, 0, 0. Therefore, 1.00, 1 is the value, 1 into 1, 1. So, a simple number we are getting. The idea of using pH scale is to get the simpler number. That we should understand first of all. All right. for any acid or any base hydrogen concentration can be expressed in terms of ph therefore we can easily compare the acidic nature or basic basic nature of the solution since for a neutral solution hydrogen concentration happens to be 10 power minus 7 when you take ph it will become ph is equal to minus log 10 power minus 7 that is 1 in 10 power minus 7 whatever it may be which is equal to minus when minus 7 comes over here as per the formula log x power a is equal to a log x here minus 1 will come over here plus minus to minus plus 7 log 10 log 10 is nothing but 1 therefore 7 ph is equal to 7 in the same manner poh can also be calculated poh hydroxide ion concentration is equal to pOH is equal to minus log hydroxide ion concentration for a neutral solution hydroxide ion concentration is only this much if you substitute again pOH will also, also become 7 that means pH will plus pOH of any solution will be equal to 14 that derivation we can see later but you should know pH plus pOH of a solution is equal to 14 7 plus 7, 14. Even for acidic solution, for acidic solution, hydrogen ion concentration will be higher. Therefore, pH will be lower. Hydrogen ion concentration higher means of the order of 10 power minus 3, minus 5 like this. If it is minus 5, the value will become 5. Therefore, if hydrogen ion concentration become higher and higher, pH value will get reduced. When the hydroxide ion concentration become higher and higher, pH get increased. So, pH plus pOH is equal to 14 for any aqueous solution, for any aqueous solution, neutral solution, 
acidic solution or basic solution for all aqueous solutions for all aqueous solutions pH plus pOH equal to 14 that you should understand all right so pH is equal to minus log to the base 10 of hydronium ion concentration pOH is equal to minus log to the base 10 of hydroxide ion concentration now if we know the value of pH how to get hydroxide hydronium ion concentration so hydronium ion concentration is equal to I want hydronium ion concentration what can I do I can take anti-log on for both sides if I take anti-log so anti-log of pH is equal to or before that let me uh, multiply both sides by minus 1 minus pH is equal to log to the base 10 hydronium ion concentration upon taking anti logarithm minus anti log uh, logarithm if i take anti log it will become hydronium ion concentration anti log p minus ph anti log of minus ph will give hydronium ion concentration i just interchanged log hydronium ion concentration is equal hydronium ion concentration is equal to minus ph so both sides i multiplied by minus 1 I got this value. When I interchange log hydronium ion concentration is equal to minus pH, I have taken anti logarithm. Upon taking anti logarithm, logarithm get cancelled, hydronium ion concentration is equal to anti log of minus pH. So, hydronium ion concentration is equal to anti log of minus pH. Alright. Hydronium ion concentration is equal to anti log of minus pH all right that you should understand then in the same manner hydronium ion concentration is equal to, since it is logarithm to the base 10 hydronium ion concentration is also equal to 10 power minus pH hydronium ion concentration is equal to 10 power minus pH just like taking anti logarithm hydronium concentration is equal to 10 power minus pH that also you know so, pH is equal to minus log hydrogenium ion concentration, pOH is equal to minus log hydroxide ion concentration, pH plus pOH for any solution is equal to 14. If I want hydronium ion concentration, nothing but anti log of minus pH, all those things we know. Now, I said earlier, pH is equal to 7 for a neutral solution. For neutral solution, pH is equal to POH is equal to 7. What about hydronium ion concentration? Hydronium ion concentration is equal to hydroxide ion concentration is equal to 1 in 10 power minus 7 mole per decimeter cube. This data we know already. And for all aqueous solutions, pH plus POH is equal to 14 or hydronium ion concentration into hydroxide ion concentration is equal to 1 into 10 power minus 14 at 25 degrees Celsius. Mole square decimated to the power minus 6. Here at 25 degrees Celsius. We consider that the, uh, almost all our experiments are carried out at 25 degrees Celsius. Now, the same derivation pH plus pOH is equal to 14 can be derived. How? Hydronium ion concentration is equal to hydronium ion concentration into hydroxide ion concentration is equal to 1 into 10 power minus 14 mole square decimeter to the power minus 6. That we know. We also know that pH is equal to minus log hydronium ion concentration. And pOH is equal to minus log hydroxide ion concentration. All these data we know. Now since these two are equal to this much, this into this is equal to this much, we can say pH before that pH plus pOH is equal to from this equation let us keep this equation aside we need not disturb this now pH plus pOH is equal to 
left hand side I have added, right hand side I can add, is equal to minus log hydronium ion concentration addition, again minus log plus of minus log hydroxide ion concentration, alright, which is equal to log A, let me take minus out, log of hydronium ion concentration plus log of hydroxide ion concentration. Am I correct? We know that log A plus log B is equal to log A B, A B, that you know already. Log X plus log Y is equal to log X Y. And therefore, minus I have taken out minus log hydronium ion concentration into hydroxide ion concentration, I can say. Am I correct? Log A plus log B is equal to log AB. Minus is common and therefore minus is taken. Now we know log of hydronium ion concentration and hydroxide ion concentration values. So minus log of hydronium ion concentration to hydroxide ion concentration which is equal to minus log. What is the value of hydronium ion concentration to hydroxide ion concentration? Which is nothing but 1 into 10 power minus 14. That is the value. If you take logarithm, what will you be getting? Minus log 1. Minus log 1 is of, of course 0. When this is taken over to the front, plus, uh, let me repeat, log 1 minus log 10 power minus 14. Am I correct? Minus is common, minus log 1 minus log 10 power minus 14. It is equal to 0. Minus 14 when it comes over here, plus 14 log 10. Plus 14 log 10 is nothing but 14 into log 10. Log 10 value is 1, therefore 14. So the value that we have got is being derived this all. Hydronium ion concentration to hydroxide concentration this much. pH plus pOH is equal to 14 for all aqueous solutions. Neutral, acidic, basic, whatever it be, for all solutions. And for neutral solution, pH is equal to pOH is equal to 7. Then, next let us go. What is it? For an acidic solution, for acidic solution, pH is greater than 7 or pH is greater than pOH. Both are correct. Sorry, pH is less than 7. Because hydronium ion concentration, let me start with hydronium ion concentration. Hydronium ion concentration is greater than hydroxide ion concentration. Hydronium ion concentration is greater than 1 in 10 power minus 7 mole per decimeter cube. That means it is of the order of 10 power minus 6 minus 5 like that. So, pH is equal to, pH is less than 7. For acidic solution, pH is less than 7. That you should understand. Hydronium ion concentration is greater than this much. That means if you take negative log to the base 10, that also I have, I have rubbed, alright, pH is equal to minus log hydronium ion concentration, pOH is equal to minus log hydroxide ion concentration, let me retain this, alright, let me need, need not rub this, hydronium ion concentration is equal to uh, anti log of minus pH. Alright, and hydronium ion concentration is also equal to 10 power minus pH. It can also be hydroxide ion concentration is equal to anti log of minus pOH. And the hydro hydroxide ion concentration is equal to 10 power minus pOH. Of course, all these data we have uh, seen already. These data I need not disturb. You should uh, have in your mind very clearly. For acidic solution, this is the case. For basic solution, for alkaline solution, for alkaline solution, hydroxide ion concentration is equal to, is greater than hydrogen ion concentration. Hydroxide ion concentration is greater than hydroxide ion concentration. That means hydroxide ion concentration will be greater than 10 power minus 7 mole per decimeter cube. 
that means poh is less than 7 or ph is greater than 7 usually we we speak in terms of ph for acidic solution ph is less than 7 for alkaline solution ph is greater than 7 if you go in terms of poh poh will be greater than 7 poh will be less than 7 usually we won't uh, compare in terms of poh so we usually speak in terms of ph only and most of the solutions acidic solutions a uh, few acids that are listed in your book battery acid battery acid acid which is used in battery it may be one molar hcl since it is one molar hcl if you calculate ph ph is equal to minus log 1 log 1 is equal to 0 ph is equal to 0 so for battery acid ph is 0 very very strong acid is used stomach acid stomach acid is also made of hcl but it's not very strong acid it is 10 power minus 1 therefore ph will be 1 vinegar vinegar is acidic acid stomach acid also contains hydrochloric acid dilute maybe 0.1 molar it is acidic acid ph is equal to for orange juice it is acidic its ph is 3 for tomato juice pH 4 black coffee black coffee 5 and then urine is also acidic it is 6 all these solutions turn like uh, uh, blue litmus into red because they are acidic it is strong acid battery acid stomach acid vinegar orange juice tomato juice black coffee and urine likewise if you go for alkaline solution, these are all acidic. Acidic solution I have listed. Alkaline solution. If I list alkaline solution. For alkaline solution, I need not go with the top. It is very strong. It is weak. Let us go with weak now. 6, 7. 7 means neutral. Water. 7. Neutral solution. Water. And then sea water, slightly alkaline, 8, baking soda, sodium bicarbonate, it is 9, uh, what is it, and then for indigestion we use tablet, tablet, tablet for indigestion, jealousy like that. It is 10. Ammonia solution. 11. Soap solution. 12. Bleaching liquid. 13. And drainage cleaner. 14. Very strong base. So for common solutions, sometimes it may be asked and therefore I have given few list. So, I have given a brief idea about pH. pH how to calculate, hydronium ion concentration how to calculate, likewise pOH, hydroxide ion concentration, pH of all solutions, pH of neutral solution, pH of acidic, pH of alkaline. Just to refer this data. In the next class, let me try to solve sums based on pH. Neutral solution, of, uh, if the solution is say uh, 10 power minus 7 acid, even that acid is acidic, pH will be slightly less. How can it be? All those things let us discuss in the next class. Thank you.